If you don't have access to a printer, watch this video so that you can learn how to draw and create your own measuring jug on a piece of paper. So all you will need for this activity is a plain piece of paper or a scrap piece of paper and a ruler and a pencil. So I'm going to start by putting my ruler on the page in a vertical direction. I'm going to count that for every one centimetre on my ruler that it is going to be worth or the equivalent of 100 mils. So I know that in a one litre container or a one, one litre is the same as 1000 mils. So I'm going to look at for every one centimetre, I'm going to add 100 mils until I get to 1000. So if I start here, I know that this is going to be one, oops. Oh. 100 mils, 200 mils, 300 mils, 400 mils, 500 mils, 600 mils, I'll get rid of that little line, 700 mils, 800 800 mils, 900, oh, 900 mils, 1000. And the little ruler keeps, obviously if you were doing this on your piece of paper, you wouldn't have the issues that I've been having, but that's okay. So you can see that for every one centimeter, I have made that, uh, I've gone up by 100 mils. So if you look at yours, um, I wonder if you could work out, well, how many centimeters you would need to, how high, how many centimeters high would you need to make your measuring jug? So if you look at it, one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So you'd have to go up 10 centimeters. So I would then rule off my measuring jug and obviously this may look messy and that's okay. The reason being is that this is just helping us to um, answer the questions. It does not need to be super, super neat. Now, if you want to go as far as putting in the 50 mil increments, you are more than welcome to do that. Now your 50 mil increments would be at the, um, the half centimeter. So for every half a centimeter, that's where you do your 50 mils. So here is my half centimeter, so I'd go 50 mils. My next half a centimeter would be there, and that's 150 mils because I know that um, between 100 and 200 is 150. Um, I would have 250 mils here, 350, 450, 550, 6. Six fifty, seven fifty, eight fifty, nine fifty. Okay, so that's how you can quickly draw it. So I've got my hundred mils in and my fifty mils in. Once again, this is very. Um, it doesn't have to be super neat. So mine is just messy, so that I can quickly do this quickly um, and then use it to answer the questions. It doesn't have to be super duper neat. All right, so now what you could do is when you're answering your questions, you can use your ruler and then you can mark it off just as I do in the demonstration that I have posted for you. So I hope this um, helps resolve the issue if you cannot print out the worksheet at home, that this is another really quick way that you can draw it on a piece of paper and use it to answer the questions. Happy learning, year three and year four.